Let's uh, welcome in our next guest. We have uh, Imtiaz Qureshi, co-founder and director at uh, Investor Financial Services. He's joining us from Mumbai. Imtiaz, thanks for being with us on NDTV Profit. What do you make of the bounce we've seen in the markets? Uh, is this good for more? What are your top picks? A very good afternoon. <coughs> Yes, uh, no doubt we are looking uh, market to be showing a bounce back, but yes, there is not confirmation has come in. Uh, we are just waiting for the market to show a resistance breakout above 8100 on a spot nifty. Once 8100 get broke out, I think so there will be a very clear indication of market going on a higher side. So definitely uh, uh, we should wait for a till expiry so that the uh, st uh, the entire rally should get uh, fizzle out and the sh uh, you can see short covering above 8100. Tomorrow would be the very big day because we are heading toward the expiry. So I think so uh, if at all, uh, well, maybe tomorrow we would see some sort of volatility and the range bound session between 8000 and 8100. But uh, after expiry, I think so the upside rally will continue. Okay, you are expecting the upside rally to continue. Um, above 8100, how much more can the Nifty jump to? How many shots are really there in the system? Uh, hasn't a lot of short covering already taken place because the Nifty futures is already in a discount and we are a day away from expiry. Uh, surely, um, uh, my sense is that uh, once we cross 8100, then whatever the fall we had seen from the level of 8600 to very close to 7900, I think so this entire rally will give uh, almost uh, you can say 38 to 50 percent of the fall get retracing that will be close to around uh, 8250 to 8300 or maybe 8200 would be the maximum upside. But this recovery depends only when at what speed we are getting recover maybe if the fall was around six to seven days and the recovery to 8200 or maybe 8500 or 8300 taking almost six to seven trading session then this will indicate that the, uh, this uh, rally is a selling opportunity or exiting from the long position how if you think that the markets uh, will see resistance at higher levels uh, what will be your top picks how would you play this bounce however high it gets to uh, very true, uh, there are the few stocks which has given a breakout and I think so there would be a very much potential the stocks to go up. One is Sun Pharma, today there has been uh, fundamental news in that Sun Pharma also and I think so Sun Pharma has just started its uh, uptrend, uh, I mean to say uptrend is uh, the fall which we have seen and we are uh, having a retracement of that fall. So this is a very clear indication that the stocks will definitely go to around 750, 760 odd level and uh, I think so there will be a real uh, can see our resistance around 760. So once uh, Sun Pharma is a very clear picture, the next stocks would be uh, st uh, uh, the entire uh, move. What we have seen, the stocks was very much well to do settle down. Hindalgo is the second stock which I would like to recommend for the metal stocks. Stocks playing a very much, uh, you can say, in line in terms of uh, technical and uh, 150, 155 is a very strong support. I think so until the stocks remains about 155. We will see higher side 192 to 100 very soon.